I sincerely apologize about it. And literally, I just want to move on. I want to move on. I, I don't want to hold. I'm not trying to pigeonhole these videos. I don't feel like I have a right to these videos or anything. I literally just want to move on, continue my channel, continue doing what I was doing and move elsewhere. I don't want nothing to do with Horror Shorts Party at this point. Hello, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, I'm not sure if y'all can hear me right now. I'm gonna try to speak as loud as possible because I don't have my, my microphone or whatnot. But um, I haven't uploaded for the past two days. It may not seem like it because I still kind of have videos in the trunk or whatnot. But um, the reason why I haven't uh, uploaded was because basically, um, you know, I was doing my daily thing. I started, um, well, let me tell you the full story. So I started coming back to YouTube in January 22nd of this year. So basically, um, I used to be on YouTube literally since 2008. So I was on YouTube and when I first started the whole YouTube thing, I started as a rapper. So when I started as a rapper, uh, I was uploading songs, uploading music videos we were shooting. Eventually, you know, I lost my videographer and uh, I decided to start shooting videos on my own. Uh, this started ranging between 2013 all the way to about 2016. So I had three, a three year run of uploading music videos literally almost every other day. Like they were coming on, you know, I was taking them down, putting them up, you know, ha having money issues, just basically going through the motions. When I was doing that, I was on a completely different YouTube. I felt like when I was uploading things and I was doing my thing back then, I did not have these issues that I have today with uploading. Like when I uploaded a video, it's weird because I could just remember uploading it, the video going up, and basically just me waiting on the processing, and basically that was really it. Now, fast forward, um, 2020, I mean, because, you know, of course I've been, you know, still shooting videos, not as frequent, but I still was kind of doing my thing. And, uh, you know, uploading videos like every blue moon, like every couple months and just doing small things. You know, of course, I also do graphic design and other things. So I was uploading things of that nature. So fast forward to 2020, I came up with a plan. So I came up with a plan. And in my plan, I was like, look, I want to start doing reaction videos. This wasn't something that I had a plan to do with malice. This wasn't something I had a plan to do to get paid. This wasn't a plan I had to do for promotion. This was a plan that I created simply because I felt like I was already doing it, just not on camera. So I was like, um, so with a little uh, inspiration from this channel I used to watch um, with my kids, my kids put me onto this channel uh, of another black gentleman. Um, his name is Corey X. Kenshin. So with Corey, watching Corey X Kitchen's videos and just uh, the humor, the memes and things like that, I was inspired. I was like, you know what? I'm, I want to put together something like that, something like that, but a little bit more grown and mature. Because if me, even though me and Corey Kitchen were close in age, but uh, I kind of felt like his videos was a little bit more kitty and I wanted to do something just a little bit more grown up. So fast forward to today, uh, uh, January uh, 22nd. I started, you know, I started doing it. So I did my first video, I want to say January 22nd, 23rd. I started uploading. And basically, um, as I was uploading, I started noticing it wasn't even that many views. Like I'm uploading, it probably was like 10 views, uh, two, three likes, one comment, something like that. And I basically was just doing it like that. Because even though I am a person who is well known, well known within the music industry, well known within YouTube. I mean, I'm not trying to brag on my name or anything, but I'm my designs and my videography work are in videos with millions of views. So I was like, you know what? I want to go ahead and build my own platform and kind of just move there, move on my own platform and just try to kind of build my own thing. You know, I've built other, you know, I helped other people build their channels and I wanted to kind of build my own channel, not knowing that while I'm building this channel, it was going to be, you know, a lot of these things that are going to be trying to stop me. 
So fast forward to today, after doing these daily uploads that I kind of planned on doing this year. Um, no, actually not today. <laughs> I'm a little bit off. It just happened two days ago. So two days ago, uh, I, I go ahead and I, I finish my video in the middle of the night, as I always do. And uh, the very next morning, I'm getting ready to upload it. As I'm getting ready to upload it, all of a sudden, I'm seeing, um, as I'm trying to upload, I'm, I'm seeing these red, just red screens, bunch of red letters basically stating that um, I can't upload and that uh, I have a copyright strike. So I automatically started thinking it was this vi this other video that I did that I really didn't even like anyway because um, in this video I was cussing a lot and I and I wasn't even feeling the footage because it was a try not to laugh video. So I'm thinking it's that. So I'm like, cool, you know, uh, I'm gonna go ahead and erase the video. I didn't really like that anyway. So I looked through the videos and within the videos it was I want to say four different videos. It was four different videos and these were uh, re all reaction videos and. Um, Basically, in these reaction videos, I base what I do is I watch videos, I, you know, I pause in, stop in, manipulation, uh, you know, add memes, humor, basically just a satire performance of watching, you know, these uh, different stories, horror stories, regular stories, try not to laugh videos, etc. So these four particular videos were all horror uh, videos and they're all made by the same channel. So, um. At first, I didn't know who was who uh, had gave me the copyright strike. I'm automatically thinking it's the algorithm because usually when you get the copyright strike, that is like it may be a song or something like that. So I'm thinking it's a song from another from one of the videos. So I'm thinking like, damn, is it my beats? Because I make beats too. I'm like, is it one of my beats as a sample or something? So I go in and I look in there, and um, it doesn't even say the exact you know uh, channel. It just says an uh, email. It's like. Um, something like that so I'm like um, like so I'm I, I go ahead and I email that person I'm just asking them like yo why am I receiving a copyright strike and literally nothing nothing no response and no nothing I waited the whole day and then um, I started doing my Googles uh, I started looking up the videos that I was reacting to because when I was reacting to these videos I wouldn't even like paying attention to the channels or anything which is stupid of me not to be paying attention but um I go and I look up these videos that got copyright strike. All of them lead back to this channel, Horror Shorts Party. 